Hi, and welcome back. My name is Alma from TwinsMommy.com, and for today, I'm gonna to show you how to edit Jasper AI content to make it your own. If you have Jasper AI, you can look at my description below. You can sign up to Jasper. And right now I'm using the boss mode plan, but you can definitely use this for the first starter plan if you want, okay? I'll go through the process. So if you go to the templates, you can look at blog. Pretty much these are for the starter plan if you just started using Jasper and you want to edit your Jasper content. You know, it passes Google little bots that they check your content. Right now they're cracking down on generated AI content, but this is, if you've ever seen it, it's it doesn't make sense, it's nonsensical. So no wonder why Google is cracking down on that type of AI content. You don't have to worry too much if you're using AI in your blog post, but remember, don't use it for all your content. Use it as an assistant. Use it as a way to help you with writer's block. Use it as a way to add more to your content. If you can only write a thousand words, have it write another 500 words. So you have a 1500 word blog post. Perfect, you can publish that. But the point is to edit Jasper. It is a lot of it's fluff writing, a lot of it's overwriting, a lot of it's wordy writing. You need to fix that and you need to add your own content to it. So under blog, let's go step by step on how to do this. If you're just brand new to Jasper and you don't know what you're going to write, let's just go through this. Let's think of some blog topic ideas. You know, my company name is Twins Mommy. The product description is what you want to blog about. You can get some ideas about your blog niche and then the tone of voice. You know, you can have fun with this. You can use celebrities if you want. I'm going to give three outputs. Now, depending on your plan, you know, this costs words, you know, I think you only get 50,000 words or 20,000 words. So, you know, be mindful of that, what it, how many you outputs you use. So I have the benefits of Twins Mommy for working at home. This is just using my company name, walking the line, finding the balance as a working mom, how to manage your time while working from home with young kids. These are all great topics. If I get rid of that, let's see, I was really interested in more creating content without burning out. Okay. Well, this is kind of neat. The top three things every new mom needs to know. I can put every new mom blogger needs to know. That is sort of a curiosity type of topic. And I like that. I'm going to copy this and I'm going to go back to Jasper and go to documents. I'm going to add new, start from scratch. I like to start from scratch. It gives me more freedom. I'm going to make this H1. By telling Jasper that this is an H1, it tells Jasper this is the topic and to go from there. I can tell Jasper just in this, what I wanted to do, list the three things every new mom blogger. I can have it create the content for me. So I have a little carrot and I just have a little direction for them. I have a list. Sometimes it will list sentences. So I have to play around with the wording, but once I have that, you just copy it and you make it run. So you need to be organized. You need to be consistent. You need to be engaged. These are fine. Again, these are the three things every new blog mom blogger needs to know. And this is where I can start editing my content. I like the organized. That's important. But the third thing I want to change. So I'm going to change this from what Jasper gave me. And I'm going to say, so I want to be realistic. So I want to have these three things. That's what Jasper is going to help me write. Right. Now, since it's only three things, I need to add more to it so that it becomes a well thought out blog post and it's not just 300 words. And that's where you would do your topical research. I would do that with uh, using hrefs. So if I found that out, I might have a subheading of, you know, my blogging journey. Let's pretend blogging journey is a keyword. So I would infuse my blogging journey and write that myself. So I would have my introduction here and then my blogging journey would be one. And then maybe to help me with income, I might have a section here of favorite blogging tools and then list those blogging tools before I get into what you need to know. And then the H2 would be, and then those would be the three things. So you can see the blogging tools I can give Jasper and then Jasper can write the product descriptions for them. I do have a video on that. So make sure you check that video out after you watch this one, but Jasper can write those product descriptions. So that is nice. I can write this and then me and Jasper can write the introduction together. I can start it and then see where Jasper takes. And then I'm going to just have Jasper compose medium length seems to be a good fit for Jasper. Jasper doesn't get too wordy and doesn't go off on a tangent. So it just really just gave me what I didn't want. I'm going to start. Okay, so in a sentence, I'm gonna see what it does. Good, so it gave me a little bit here and that's fine. I can see, definitely move that out. And then if I wanted to, I can use the paragraph generator and plug in this. You can plug it into 800 characters and then I don't put a keyword in and then I put something like, sometimes it'll add Kylie Jenner to the output, but I wanna see how it generates a paragraph with what I have here. Okay, so I like some of this stuff here. So I've already said, I've seen the highs and lows of the business 
business and then I can continue. I've seen bloggers who are barely scraping by and I've seen bloggers who are raking in six figure incomes. And then the truth is there's no guarantee of success in this in this business. And here's where I'm gonna start editing the content. So even though Jasper gave me this and I'm going to be billed for the you know words that it gave me, I need to edit the content and you can edit it within Jasper or put this right in your blog post and edit it then. But I really like to edit it as I'm working. Theme is mom bloggers, my audience. I'm going to stress that. I don't like, just remember it's not gonna be all rainbows and butterflies. I'm gonna remove that. And I don't normally say you can achieve, achieve great things in my content. There will be challenges, but if you stick with it and you have the support, which I would link like to my course, Ready, Set, Block for Traffic, for example. And then I would do that. I would run my blogging journey, but then I would go into my blogging tools, like I said, with the product descriptions. And then the three most important things to remember. So for this, I'm gonna give it the, the instruction. Let's see what it does. It's still saying all of that. Okay, you're probably excited about the process of starting a mom blog. It can be a great way to make money right from home and it can be rewarding in many ways. But before you dive in, there are a few things you need to know. That's nice. And then I would write some things here in the content because again, I don't want all Jasper to write it. It is, like I said, it's a little Let's see what Jasper says. Okay, perfect. So that's a nice little, you know, add on there. And then we'd get into that. So a lot of it with Jasper is removing unnecessary dribble and cutting some of its sentences down so that it's not as wordy. But so far, this is fine. Like I said, I'd probably do like 80% of my own writing and then a bit of Jasper. Other days, it might be 50-50, but generally I do want a good part of my own writing, my own personality in, in my content, especially for my brands. It's not so much for my niche sites and other sites for my brands. I do want that personality. So if you're using Jasper for your own blog, you do need to dance with it. I suggest your introduction is you and then Jasper, not Jasper and then you. Use the paragraph generator that really helps with elongating that paragraph. And then you decide the H2s for some of them and you get Jasper to maybe devise the list for it. And then you go from there and just realize that once you get that top from Jasper, spend the time finding the SEO keywords, find the time to have a blog outline. All of those are important. And then you use Jasper to help you structure your blog post in a way so that you are writing most of it. And Jasper is helping you fill in those gaps so that it's long form. So that's how I edit my content. And, and it's really helped me with creating consistent content over time. So hopefully that helped you. Make sure to check out my link. If you want to try out Jasper below, get a free trial of using Jasper. All right.